Hello and welcome. This is the 1111 edition of Treasure Chest Tuesday. So we're focusing more on 1111 than we are on the Tuesday part. <laughs> so welcome. So good to be with you at this particular gateway, this particular opening, this particular expanded time that's actually already started. And I'll be transparent with you. I had a little bit of more difficulty making this video along with the newsletter that I send out that has a video in it on my email list um, <clears throat> this week because of everything going on. And at spiritual levels, yes, but we know in the world of the United States election, it's had a big trajectory, a big impact on all of us. And for me personally, it has uh, brought, surfaced a lot of old feelings, new feelings, historical feelings, soul level challenges, you name it. They're all combined um, in relationship to the outcome of that. And so I've had to be with myself around that, be with others around that, be with uh, a group, our sacred soul circle around that. And every moment, every day, it just keeps changing. The perspectives, the insights, the, the grief, the feelings, all of that keep changing. So how to land all of that in this one video and also be very respectful and mindful of this 1111 gateway because that's the purpose of doing this video. So I am so grateful that I can bring a piece into the equation. And many people have brought me other pieces, whether it's um, audios, videos, uh, written material that feeds into all of this. So we're very blessed right now to feel that there's a collective movement of un understanding of where each one is and where the collective is portions of the collective so <clears throat> that you might resonate with and that's why you're listening to this um, video on this channel. So <clears throat> know that wherever you are is right for you. Wherever you are is exactly okay for you and we're all going to feel a little different and that's okay. And knowing that it's important to be able to have support and reach out and be with people who may be in a slightly different place in the process, but they have understanding for where you are, you have understanding for where they are. That is all part of what we're um, bringing forward in this one, 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 one um, time of the 1111 gateway. We all are creating from the light that we are, where we are, in our connection of mastery. One is a mastery number. Eleven is a mastery number. Eleven, eleven is a collective mastery number. So we're all in our sovereign place of creation. And we're collectively creating a heart of mastery. The mastery of the soul, the mastery of the heart, is connected to the amount of light of our, is connected to the light that we are connected to. Does that make sense? <laughs> our individual light of connection creates that part of our sovereignty. And I have to mention that the flowers next to me, they're usually in this kind of state of a feeling that um, they're just barely about to open. But I think that was very symbolic of where we are. So much wanting to open with this 1111 gateway because it is a gateway for manifestation as well. So much wants to open and is on the brink of opening. And I want you to remember that even when it feels like so much potentially is closing down. It's our perception and where we are on the um, trajectory of where we're going. Remember, we have not created the future yet. We create the future. Yep, individually and together. We create it. 
It hasn't been created yet because we haven't done it yet, right? So we have a lot of input <clears throat> spiritually um, and emotionally and in the physical world. So don't forget the importance of your light, the importance of your part, and the importance of your heart connection and your soul connection at this time. So I want to share a meditation with you to honor this 1111 time <clears throat> and to honor this time of the expansion of light while we deepen our connection to our individual light. So let's take a few deep breaths. <coughs> that was good. <clears throat> A few deep breaths to make room for all that wants to come into our heart space at this gateway. It really is about our receptivity to light that wants to come in. So as we feel this breath of life, <coughs> there we go, that we are making room for more of the light of us to come in into our expression, into our heart, all the way down into our abdomen. Take a deep breath, a belly breath, deep inside, and another one. And then put your attention on creating your own light within your heart. Maybe it's a candle. Maybe it's a star. Those can be useful images. See, sense, feel that light in your heart. And take a breath to allow it to expand in your heart, its presence. And to make more room in your heart for that light, allow yourself to not only take a breath, but think of someone or something you love or appreciate. And then bring that light into that more open space in your heart of appreciation. For the light is always here. Your light is always here. We are just putting our full attention on it. How beautiful. So then what I want you to do is as you feel this light in your heart, or see this light in your heart, imagine that your light is connected to the light of everyone in essence, but the light of those who are honoring this time right now, especially all around the world. And I want you to imagine like a stadium, a big collection in front of you of people in human form, Maybe they don't have faces right now, but they're real beings <clears throat> in human form in front of you in this big stadium. Maybe it's a Roman Colosseum. It can be whatever you perceive right now. And they're each holding a light. Maybe they're holding a candle. Or you see a light in their heart revealing itself. Let yourself imagine that, create that, let that come into your heart space, the sensation of appreciation of it. <clears throat> How much light, <clears throat> it could be even a billion lights, right? We don't know, but everyone has some light within them. Everyone on the planet has that spark of light. And as you sense or feel or see that light in the stadium of humanity, 
Feel yourself in appreciation for it. That you are connected to it right now. And whatever it is you choose to create in this time ahead, moving through the gateway, the 1111 gateway, <clears throat> and into the next 20 days, what is it you want to create from the power of your light? What is it you want to create from the power of your light <clears throat> that lives within you? And this is something you can do after the meditation. Put attention on that. What is it you want to create from the power of your light? And then you're going to feel or see that the light <clears throat> of the billions of people holding their light amplify what it is you want to create of your light, what you want to manifestate. Manifest <clears throat> of the creation of your light. Here and now and in the days to come. You bring power to it and then it has manifestation properties in spades. And then what I want you to do is imagine a billion stars, a billion stars out in the sky that create light, twinkling, moving, stationary. Imagine <clears throat> as you move in your awareness into the universe that there's a billion stars reflecting the light here and increasing the light here, going back and forth between you and that beautiful billion lights out there. See, sense, feel those billion lights lighting up the sky of your universe, connecting to the light within you and the billion lights of humanity on this planet now, all in motion together, all in the oneness of manifestation of a force field of the power of light to create what is yours to create, and thus all of us together. Stay with this for as long as you wish. Be in this light of the 1111 gateway. Know that as you bring this light in, everything that is less than light will be moved out of this sphere of the field of light easily, naturally. I thank you for taking this moment <clears throat> with me and with the others listening to this, seeing this unconsciously with this light of this gateway at this time. And if you wish to share this video with friends who would like to have a little ritual to do on this 1111 gateway or in the next 20 days, please feel free. And if you want to hear more from me around the 1111 gateway, you can go to soulmastery.net. My email list there will open the door for you to hear even more of what I have to share at this time. And always, I love sharing with you, being with you, connecting with you, light to light, heart to heart, with blessings on this great gateway for our lives together in the power of light. <clears throat>